This week, the Wiregrass saw its coldest temperatures of the season. Mercury readings dropping into the low 20s across much of the WDHN viewing area. And what's good in the neighborhood this week, Mike Gerspan spent time at the Christian Mission Center as volunteers helped find shelter for those without a roof over their head. Uh, I know it sounds crazy. Dorothy Ann Boyers credits the Christian Mission with saving her life this week. Due to a series of tragic circumstances, the 65-year-old Hartford native found herself recently homeless. On Tuesday night, with attempts dipping into the 20s, an Enterprise police officer found Dorothy trying to stay warm on the streets. He brought her to the Christian Mission, where she was given an overnight accommodation. Yes, it's very cold, and uh, there's nowhere for homeless people to be. Uh, you can't be on private property. You, uh, the only thing you can do. Uh, is maybe not get caught on a property that's been abandoned. The Christian Mission founder, Reverend John Belcher, being able to provide shelter for those without a roof over their heads or without heat is part of the mission statement. Uh, the Christian Mission Center wants to be sure that everyone that uh, does not have a home, uh, that does not have to be out in this weather, and that they've got food to eat and adequate clothing and all for this time of the year. It is very Christian oriented and uh, it, it does more things for people in my situation that could really help others uh, get out of the situation I'm in. During these times of extreme cold temperatures in the winter time here in the Wiregrass, Reverend Belcher and the Christian Mission providing needed shelter for those without a roof over their heads. In Enterprise for what's good in the neighborhood, Mike Urspan, WDHN News. The Christian Mission Center of Enterprise relies solely on the generosity of individuals like you at home, churches and businesses throughout the area as well. If you'd like to help the faith-based organization and folks who are down on their luck, you can give them a call at 393-2607. That's going to do it for the 5 o'clock news tonight, friends. We thank you so much for allowing us into your home each week. God bless you, and for all of us here at WDHN, have a great and safe weekend. We'll see you Monday.